How's it going everybody? Reed Ward Turbo and today I've got another uh, another turbo on the bench to show y'all guys. Got the new Zona Rotor. Well I say new, this one's been out for a while but it does have some updated features. This is the XR6564S with the X3C compressor cover. For those of y'all not familiar with Zona, they are owned by Tile Sport, the people that make the the real high quality wastegates and uh, blow off valves and Zona is their turbo lineup. Most of this unit is made right here in the United States, actually right up in Michigan and uh, super high quality. I'm stoked to have their product available to y'all guys. So what is uh, what is an XR6564S X3C? Well, easy. 65 means 65 pounds per minute of airflow out of the compressor group, so that'll supply up to about 600 and, in my experience, about 660, 670 horsepower, maybe a little bit more on a really efficient modern engine. Um, X3C is uh, the compressor cover size, so four inch by two and a half. So this is common with like a Garrett GT35 uh, as far as a footprint goes. The compressor wheel on this one measures 58 millimeter inducer or minor and 79 millimeter exducer or major. The 64S in the name of the turbo is, uh, is the turbine wheel. The turbine wheel is a 64 millimeter exducer. The S means it's their split blade design or their ultra high flow UHF turbine. This is pioneered by Zona. You've seen a lot of copies of it out there, I'm sure, by now. But uh, it's a split blade design, so a primary blade that's low, then a secondary blade that's high. So you get a little bit of, uh, of choke flow elimination and also some mass reduction in that design. So it helps with the spool and still flows really, really well for its size. Of course, tile exhaust housing being uh, zone is owned by tile. Wouldn't expect anything less. They have V-band inlet and T3 inlet, as well as some internal wastegated V-band and T3 footprints available as well. Um, one of the coolest parts about this turbo is the cast stainless bearing housing. It's very minimalistic. Has your water cooling ports, oil feed. There is an integrated uh, screen filter inside of there to help keep catastrophic debris out of your turbo if something were to happen. Um, snap ring retained compressor cover with an O-ring, so easy to clock. Uh, just standard six bolt turbine connection point, so super sturdy and robust on that side. Let's see, what are these good for? Uh, you know. Uh, the the Zona, I guess the Zona family pretty much covers anything in the G series Garrett from the G G twenty five five fifty all the way up to we're gonna say the G the G forty um, package. Uh, so the largest of the Zona is a seventy six millimeter compressor wheel that's one hundred and fifteen pounds per minute or basically twelve hundred horsepower. And the smallest, I believe, is a 48 uh, pound per minute or 500 horse uh, unit. But anyway, this is a uh, kind of just an overview of this particular turbo because we just got it in stock. But uh, we have access to the entire Zona catalog. So if you don't see something on my website on workturbochargers.com, look on zonarotor.com and see if there's something there that you would like a quote on and drop me an email and I'll be happy to uh, give you a quote. We've got these guys running around on SRs, uh, got a few on some Subarus, and this one right here is actually going to our friends up at Midnight Auto in Huntsville to go on a uh, on a really, really nice SR build. We also have these in Twins on some LS uh, builds. A uh, good friend of mine, Ed, down in Florida, has a Sick Week slash Drag Week Nova that is uh, running really, really good with a pair, pair of these units on his LS. Uh, he has the 70 two millimeter versions if I remember right, but we can help you uh, decide what Zona might be right for you. So just drop me a line and we'll, we'll, we'll happily quote it. Let's see, uh, what else have I forgotten? Uh, went over uh, XR6564S and what all that nomenclature means. It's all made, uh, well, majority of it's made here in the United States. I think the, the bearing structure and turbine wheel might come out of Germany, but don't quote me on that. I'd have to get with, uh, 
get with the guys at Zona and just make sure. Um, but the, uh, nonetheless, super high quality. Um, we have uh, had nothing but positive results out of them, so we're super proud to to offer these up for y'all guys. But hey, we appreciate you watching and hope you find these uh, videos kind of entertaining. Uh, hope y'all guys have a great day. Do all those things YouTube wants you to do to help us grow this little bitty channel. Appreciate y'all guys.